that is one of those benefits of using the right interface for AR. So every tool that lets you plug in um, a, a tool such as using the model context protocol or something like Claude, or if you're using Claude code, accessing different tools, there are usually interfaces designed for humans and then there are interfaces designed for AI agents. And to give a concrete example, if you're vibe coding, you like Claude code and you want to use GitHub, there are two different ways you can use GitHub to make PRs, you know, make a, you know, merge them, manage your commits, manage your, your, your branches. And one of them is the command line. You can just, Claude knows how to write a, a GitHub command. And the other one is an MCP server. Now, this is like lesser known about that MCP server, but if you use the GitHub MCP server, it has explicit restrictions on what can and cannot be done. And it will make sure that when PRs are made, it's tied to an agent identity. GitHub is tracking when something comes through MCP, when it comes through an AI agent, as opposed to coming through your command line, which looks like you. That is one of those benefits of using the right interface for AI. And I think this analogy can apply a bunch about across a bunch of different tools. Um, but having that interface and declaring it up front, especially if you're building AI tools, I think is super helpful, not just for you and your own management, but to offer to your consumers, to you know, other folks using the tools you build, that something is AI and work towards this better identity infrastructure.